Hello, my name is Christy, and I graduated from Century College back in 2009. When I started attending classes at Century College, I didn't know what I wanted to be. I took a bunch of random classes to try to find out what kind of a career I would be interested in. I ended up taking Intro to Engineering, um, Design Basics, I took a programming class, I uh, took a constitutional law class, and I finally found a class called Intro to Computer Forensics. And I really, really enjoyed that class and found out that that's what I wanted to do with my um, career life. So I jumped in full-fledged and I graduated from that program in about a year and a half. And upon graduation, I had applied at a law enforcement agency and was offered the position and I moved and ended up starting my very first job in computer forensics in 2010. After I graduated from Century College, I started working in the computer forensic field in law enforcement, and we were using a software called NCASE, and I have my NCASE uh, Certified Examiner's certification, and what that means is that I passed a, a written test, and then I passed a practical exam using my forensic skills that I learned at Century College and throughout the training programs that the software company provided. I attribute a lot of my career success to Century College. Not only did we have a rigorous training program where I learned the skills that I needed to do my job, it also got me in touch with excellent faculty members who to this day are still mentors of mine. Um, I also have other students who I still reach out to and keep in contact with, and it's really helped me create a community for this career field that I'm in called Digital Forensics. Short-term goals versus long-term goals. For me, my short-term goal was to have a job after I graduated from um, Century College, which I did. I ended up working in law enforcement and I did that for three years. And then I went on to work for a major medical institution. And since then I have worked for a major retailer and now I work in financial services. Um, I am now a manager in the information security team and I am over digital forensics, e-discovery, uh, records, and data mapping. If not IT, then what? Well, that's pretty easy for me to answer. Um, prior to going to school, I had been working at a telecommunications company for six years, and I worked out in customer service. When 2008 came around, there was a downturn in the economy and many people lost their jobs, and that was me. If, I, if that had not happened, I probably wouldn't have gone back to school and I would have stayed at that customer service job. So for me, it's pretty easy that I would just be in some customer service position that paid my day-to-day -day bills that wasn't a career that I really enjoyed.